right, so what's up, fam? Yo, we live, we live. Man, I just uh, decided to go ahead and drop this live. Uh, due to the fact that, first of all, YouTube is tripping, but second of all, I wanted to do this live. I meant to do this live uh, quite a bit ago, but just so happy to get around to it. So, look, today we got Talladega versus Jackson State. Now, I'm not going to lie. Uh, when this battle happened, Facebook was going bananas. Uh, folks was giving their perspective on how it should go and how it should sound. But look, we're going to do this live reaction, y'all. We're going to see, you know, how it go. Now, of course, majority of everybody already know my perspective on these bands right here. Both of these bands have made tremendous strides and becoming better. But we also got to see that because... Talladega from the videos that I've seen in the clips, Talladega is like dumb clean now. They, you, they always been loud. Always been. So, you know, we're going to see what's, what's popping. Salute, Yella, how you doing? Now, we're going to get into this. We're going to break this down. We're going to see now. Is Talladega going to reign supreme over Jackson State? Or is Jackson State going to take that crown? We're going to see. So, let's go ahead and slide on into this, this nice little battle. Hold on, hold on, hold on. First of all, Jackson State covered with that, that dumb heat. Hey, my goodness. All right. Let, hey, look, let's keep this rolling. Let's keep this rolling. We got to keep this rolling, man. Shout out to Killer Kale. He the one that did this. Okay. Okay.
Come on, Zai, gotta give me a little bit more. Okay, so we see where this coming from. Like, both of them blowing. Both of them blowing, y'all. But the thing about it is we got to, this got to be really inspected. That's that's the major thing about this battle between these two. They're known for power, both of them. Especially Tyler Dagger. They known for power. Uh, Jackson State, known for power, too. So we got to we gotta really look at some stuff now. We got to look at the arrangements we got to look at the execution. We got to check those two those two parts of the program out. We got to look at that. So this going to get this going to be a nice one. Let's get to it. That's messed up. Told them for their songs denied. See what Talladega got.
so right here, Tyler Lega, I see what you was doing. I see what you was doing, what you was trying to do. Now, they're playing their own game, but at the same time, like, what you did was you kind of changed the dynamics of how everything was going because everything was crunk at first, but then you hit it with that little old school tune. But those dynamics that you put in place wasn't used correctly like how it should have been. It would have been a little bit more effective if this, uh, that melody part came out a little bit more and those trombones toned it down. Because right now, the trombones are sitting way too high on the band. When I needed the trombones to sit on the band, they didn't do it. So right now, they sitting on top and covering up that melody. Then, I'm sorry, I'm a stickler for this. The ending, that was too open of a gap to the ending come. That's just too much. So, you already know where this went. But let's keep it going, y'all. I think we need a round three. I think we need a round three. to the end when they put that cold hearted snake ending to this song it, it threw me off completely I'm sorry Tyler Dago y'all better come back it's open
opinion, y'all just gave it right back to Jackson State. That arrangement, bro, that Jones is. One more round. Let's give him one more round. I can't. I can't even lie. They that would that wouldn't right there. I would not even chose that song to even arrange. To be honest with you. Yeah, I would have left that arrangement alone. And some of the some of the chord progressions was kind of weird. All right, Jack State, what y'all got? Right, y'all. I was hoping that was coming back too. They, I don't know what they were thinking about with that one. With it, man. <laughs> See, the march of him and Juke Boom of Alabama. <laughs> Killing Talladega is the arrangements. 
you cannot you cannot always write your music in the sky as you can hear they baritones got thinned out on one part of the melody and then they, uh this other part near the ending what they was doing is it's you can hear that it was like they skipping a the beat to make sure they hit this other note like come on now this this gotta stop like, y'all got to really hone in on these arrangements. The, the arrangements going to make, I promise you the arrangements going to make that program. If they get some fire arrangements, shit, you ain't touching Talladega then. But they got to come with it, man. <laughs> I do that hair woo. <laughs> Jackson State that part because I know the first time they played this song, them baritones did not get that note. All right, TC, what y'all got? Y'all probably got a chance, man. Drum I can see y'all do y'all thing now.
played it safe with this song, I ain't gonna lie to you. Yeah, Mellow King, that last song Tyler Day played. saved it a little bit but like i said this ain't a song i would have gave to my program uh went to the concession stand line. Both of those songs that played that round, I would have went and got some food. I'm sorry. My guy, what's up? 
Okay, they come. Okay, for the Drake round, we're gonna call this the Drake round. Now, for this round, is this is really an iffy battle. Like, was I impressed by both arrangements? No, I was not. Uh, the trombone part for Talladega was interesting. I'm gonna I'm say it like that interesting. The reason why I say interesting is because of that little uh, trombone lick that they be doing. Like, that's in my opinion, that's my opinion. For a soloist, hey, it's killer. It's killer. But as a, a complete band and everybody doing that, I don't really like that because they give off a weird sound. And it just don't sound right. So, I, I don't know, man. Both of them arrangements didn't intrigue me. Really. That was exciting right there. Was I guess he must have changed out the battery. Anybody that's asking questions, why he talking about that on trombones? I started out on trombones, so I do know uh, the trombone very well. Just letting you know. <laughs>
legitimately just play, oh no, oh no, I would not have wrote that out. No. That's a big no. like the song either way but Tom Baker had it better. So last two. This one and the last one Tom Baker was getting at. Come on Jackson State.
or sandals. the song like he missed out on so much color in this song because he wrote it for power it's so much color in this song he could have added way more in there i promise you but i like it i like it brother dj been saying last song for the night for about 15 minutes bro just shut up and let the bands play bro was nice. Uh, he missed it on some dynamics. <laughs> They, they 
stay clean with this.
They feed them. They feed the right. beats on gunpowder. <laughs> For every game, take a spoonful of this gunpowder. Damn. Okay then. Oh, so I guess this is it right here. So look, that that was a cool battle. Like I said, but uh, if if I'm banking it off of Ranger Salon because. Both of them was powerful. That's the thing. Uh, Jackson State started off early. They started off real early. So that early part caught Dega. I promise you, Dega would have came out with some of them uh, songs earlier. They probably would have most definitely got the W. Jackson State skated by. And the reason why they skated by was because of some of their arrangements was more intricate. Uh, they were a little bit more cleaner. Now, as far as people saying that, uh, as far as people saying that, you know, hey, Jackson State ain't got no trumpets. When have Jackson State ever had trumpets? When, when, what year was that? 2010 or something? Look, I'm a person that's been in band for a little long, little bit. So, I ain't gonna lie, Jackson State, the last time Jackson State had trumpets is when they had Trump Funk. After Trump Funk, I don't know what happened to the section. I, I really don't. They've never been aggressive anymore. Uh, but Talladega Trombones was kind of, it was like they was hopscotching up top. They were playing. They could have been, they could have been a lot louder. Literally. So, I to to be honest, this was a, a dumb close battle. Dumb close. And it should not even been that close. So, my major props go out to, go out to Talladega. Because they came with it. They came with it. They literally came with it. So, like, I got a lot of people, like, Melo, he said 08. Tim, you said 13. Uh, 13 kind of iffy. 12. Somewhat. But, like, they ain't, they, just Jackson State never really had aggressive trumpet players until Trump, Trump I guess they just disappeared off the face of the earth. But, it was just, that just was crazy. But, you know, great battle. Great battle. Uh, we're going to possibly get into uh, either the Southern versus Texas Southern, or we're going to do the uh, Jackson State and Alabama a and I don't know which one I'm going to do next. Uh, but that's going to drop tomorrow. We'll probably do the same live around this time, uh, around about 5 o'clock. So, you know, Look, thank y'all for stopping by, pulling up, and showing your boy love. Man, look, make sure y'all make sure y'all hit that like button on the way out. Hey, share this joint if you want to. Go ahead and share it. Uh, let's get it out there. And man, look, I'm gonna catch y'all tomorrow. Uh, I don't know which one we're gonna do. It may be the uh, Jackson State, Alabama a and or it may be the Southern University Texas Southern. Uh, JSU and AMU was better. Okay. So that may be the one we uh may look at. Let me see. You stop saying yes, sir. You right. Jess, you leans on dog team way too much, but you gotta realize too, they know their strong points. They know dog team gonna handle their business, and they know their baritones is gonna make it ring. They know their trombones is gonna hold that foundation down. So they really, the melophones are there for that extra support. So you really, they really ain't got. Uh, they really ain't gotta arrange it tough for their trumpet players. See, you see where I'm getting at? They they know how to arrange it for their band program, and they doing a good job. You gotta give them their props on that. They doing a hell of a job doing that. So, look, everybody, with that being said, make sure y'all like, y'all comment, y'all subscribe, make sure you hit the bell so you know when your boy uploading. And also, look, we going to head on now. Make sure y'all become part of the game. So, with that being said, y'all, look, peace, love, a whole lot of hair grease. Keep banding your life. And we out. <laughs>